Hi caregivers, it's Molly Connor Hall. I am an occupational therapist with Valley Health and we've been doing some videos on tools and strategies for self-regulation and this video is going to talk about mindfulness and grounding. So our goal for this video is to identify what mindfulness is and why it can help with managing stress. We also want to teach you a quick mindfulness exercise that you can use with yourself and your children at any time. Um, so to talk about mindfulness first, this is going to be a, a review if you did watch our mindfulness and deep breathing video. Mindfulness can be used as an intervention to manage stress and anxiety. It encourages individuals to be present and connected in the moment to promote mental and physical health. So when we're present in the moment, we're not worried about things in the past or things that are coming up in the future. We're focusing on this moment in time. And that means, you know, being aware of where you are, who you're with, and also being accepting of how you're feeling in this moment. So as promised, this is a fun, easy, and quick activity you can do anywhere. I did it before this video, and I promise you, I helped me feel more relaxed and more present in this moment. It's a grounding activity, which helps you to be in the moment and focus less on your thoughts. Um, it's called the five senses activity. So the first thing you're gonna do is think about five things you see. Um, when I'm teaching this to children and adults, I am encouraging them to think about things that are not as obvious, um, looking for details that you wouldn't normally notice. So when I was doing this video, or before this video, when I was doing this activity, I saw um, different colors in the wood on my table. Um, you know, I might notice on my Christmas tree, a light starting to go out on my string of lights. Um, so really slowing down and, and being aware of the things that you see and thinking about things that you wouldn't normally notice. Um, the next one is four things you feel. So this could be the temperature, this could be clothes that you're wearing, it could be, um, you know, wh where your hands are resting. So um, my hands might be on a smooth table or they might be touching, um, my, my hands might be touching each other and I can feel that my fingers are cold. I might feel that I have thick socks on because it's winter time, or I might notice that um, I am wearing a really soft shirt today. Um, the next one is three things you hear. Um, again, I, I like to um, really slow down and be a little bit more aware of what I'm hearing. So if I hear a dog barking, I try to think about if the dog is nearby or far away. If I hear a humming sound, is it the, the, the heater or is it maybe an appliance in my kitchen? Um, the next one is two things you smell. And the last one is one thing you taste. So maybe you just ate something or you just brushed your teeth or you drank something or just had a, a piece of candy. Um, I th think this is, uh, again, just a fun, quick, easy activity. And it could be really fun right now around the holidays because there's lots to see, feel, hear, smell, and taste. The last thing I want to um, share with you is that when we are teaching mindfulness, it can be really helpful to have a model. So caregivers, um, I know that you all are doing so much for others. Make sure that you're taking time for your own mental and physical health. Um, when you're doing this, you're being a great model for your child. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you um, found it helpful, please make sure to check out our other videos. We have one on mindfulness and deep breathing, and another one on self-regulation. Thanks again for watching this video.